Hello and welcome to another video. My name is Boxiest, and today we are going to continue the What If series. What if events had gone differently? And in this What If, we're going to change the history of Cobra Kai. What if Hawk killed Brux during the events of Cobra Kai Season 3? So in this timeline, the events of Cobra Kai Season 1 would still happen. Kyler, Brux, and his friends would still bully Miguel, Eli, and Dimitri. And those events would stay the same. Miguel would still fight Kyler and his friends at the cafeteria. And the events of Season 1 would carry on. Eli would still become Hawk in this timeline. And the events of Season 2 and Season 3 would still happen. Hawk would be Cobra Kai's number one student at Cobra Kai. And he would be trained by Kreese. He would want to be Cobra Kai's next All Valley Champion. So Hawk would continue training at Cobra Kai. And Cobra Kai would still have a rivalry with Miyaido. Kreese would want to go recruit some new students for Cobra Kai, and he would still want to get Kyler and his friends. So Kyler and his friends would still show up at the Cobra Kai dojo, and Hawk would be surprised to see them. He would want to tell Kreese that they weren't Cobra Kai material, but Kreese would say that Cobra Kai needed natural athletes, and the events of Season 3 would carry on. Kreese would still get the students to try out for Cobra Kai, so Kyler would still fight Mitch in this timeline, and he would still get in. And much like in the original timeline, Brux would fight Hawk, those events would stay the same. Hawk would be fighting with Rage, and he would take it out on Brux. And in this timeline, Hawk wouldn't be holding back, and he would take out all his anger on Brux. So Hawk would kill Brux in this timeline, the whole dojo would be shocked, and most of the Cobra Kai students would look at Hawk in fear. Kreese would be surprised by Hawk, but he would be proud, and Kyler would be frozen with fear. Hawk would look at Brux, and he wouldn't believe what he had done. One of the Cobra Kai students would rush out of there, and they would call the police. The police would show up, and they would arrest Hawk. So Hawk would be sent to Juvie for murder. And in Juvie, Hawk would be forced to shave off his mohawk, but he wouldn't lose his confidence. And Robbie would be surprised to see Hawk there, so Hawk and Robbie would still be enemies. Sean and his friends would try messing with Hawk. Sean and his friends would be on Robbie's side, but Hawk would fight back, and he would eventually earn Sean's respect. But in this timeline, Hawk wouldn't join Sean's friend group. News would spread that Hawk killed Brux, Miguel would find out, and he would want to go visit Hawk, and Hawk would be happy to see Miguel, and Miguel would ask Hawk why he killed Brux. Hawk would say it was an accident, but that Brux deserved it for everything that he did to them. Miguel would tell Hawk that that wasn't him talking, that it was Kreese, and that he got in his head, but Hawk wouldn't want to listen to Miguel, and the events of Season 3 would carry on. Johnny would still form Eagle Fang in this timeline, and those events would stay the same. The rivalry between Robbie and Hawk would continue, but eventually Robbie would be released from Juvie. Kreese would visit Hawk at Juvie on occasion. Even Dimitri would try visiting Hawk in Juvie. And at first, Hawk wouldn't want to see Dimitri. But eventually Hawk would realize that what he did was wrong, and he would forgive Dimitri. So Dimitri and Hawk would start to become friends again. So in this timeline, Hawk would remain in Juvie, and he would eventually go to prison for the remainder of the series. And that is where I'm going to end this what if. Thank you guys for watching. What do you guys think would have happened if Hawk killed Brux during the events of Cobra Kai Season 3? Let me know in the comments below. YouTube lets me know that the majority of you are not subscribed, so if you guys could subscribe, that would be much appreciated. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like this video, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see you guys next time.